Alright, Bonnie, what's up? Oh, Mr. Marston. How are you doing today? I'm well, Miss McFarland. Thank you. How are you? Well, I'm fine. Thank you. So, uh, how are your ribs? Fine. A little sore, but apart from a couple extra scars, it'll be as nothing happened. Ribs good. sounds good. Uh, come in, come in. You know, you never did tell me how you met that Bill Williamson or what you wanted from him. No, miss, I did not. Well, why not, if you don't mind me asking? I certainly don't mind you asking if you don't mind me not telling. See, it's a complicated and somewhat pathetic tale, and by telling you, not only would I be putting your life in danger, but also threatening the lives of some people that I hold very dear. Well, I apologize if I seem to be prying. And I apologize for my reticence. Hope you believe me when I say that it's simply out of respect for you. Of course, Mr. Marston. I understand that a city dweller such as yourself likes to have some exotic secrets, so us country folk are impressed. <laughs> I'm no city man, miss. Yeah, but I saw you get on the train at Blackwater. You with those gentlemen in bowler hats? I'm still no city man. But I'll bet you can't ride, Mr. Marston. I hate to take money from a lady, miss. <laughs> oh, you won't be. I'll race you right now. If it makes you happy. We'll see. All right, ma'am. You want to race? Let's race. All right, I'll show you how we ride around these parts. Oh hell no! I don't, I will kick your I'll kick your ass, lady. Let's go. Did she just rubber band back? Yeah. Go to the race start over here. All right. Here we go. Let's do this. On the count of three. Three. Two. two one. Go. I trust you're not gonna be a gentleman about this! Oh hell no, I'm no, kicking no, your no, ass, no, woman! <laughs> Ain't no being nice about this, I'm kicking your ass. I'm gonna make you call me daddy. Alright? Uh-uh, I'm yeah. in the lead and I'm gonna stay there. And if you get in front of me, I'm gonna Can shoot your horse. You catch up? Yeah. How about them apples? Cause I'm packing a rifle. If you haven't noticed. Are you saving the best for last? God, these taunts. I bet you're starting to regret your brave work. Oh shit! Woo! You like me to slow down? God, okay, come on, keep it going, keep it going. Go, dear. Oh. Back there. Keep going. Almost got off the track. How do they know where they're racing exactly? Like, he doesn't know this area, somehow he knows exactly where to go in the race. That makes sense. Let's go! I'm tapping it every couple of seconds, keep me up. I don't know about you guys, but... Have you guys seen Infamous Second Son? That game is looking fantastic. Every time I see uh, more of it... Hey! 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 What the hell? What the hell, lady? Oh, hell no! Hey! Oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on, Mr. Marston! I'm coming! I'm coming! Oh, I got you! Oh, I got you! Oh, damn. That was close. That's the best you can do! Woo! Oh, man. Scared me. I thought for, I thought, uh oh, I don't know if I was gonna do it. I wonder how they've managed to set up all these little bonfires on the track. It's impressive. Fancy that like last minute. Let's go! On an unplanned race. Come on! And surprised I'm not worried about forest fires. Or I should say field fires. Woo! That I thought I was gonna lose there. Thank God. Slow down. Yeah, that was fun. Sure. You know, you should go pay the marshal a visit in Armadillo sometime. Chicken. I'm sure he could help you deal with that nice Mr. Williamson. 
Yeah, I might just do that, Miss McFarland. You do whatever you think best, Mr. Marston. That's just leaning against the pole. Sup, bro? How's it going? Hey, come on! Perdóname, señor. Didn't do anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Careful. Woo, okay. That was worth 40 bucks. <laughs> I didn't do anything at all. They, it cannot be proven in a court of law. <laughs> Hello there. What's up? Hi, officer. What's up? Did someone kill someone? <gasps> the horror! Oh man, I wonder who did that. Some asshole. Boom, boom. Ah, oh, Mr. Marston, how are you? Good, Miss McFarland, how are you? I'm well. Would you mind riding with me to Armadillo? I've got to get some supplies and I could do with the company. Of course. You can take the reins. It wouldn't do for a terrifying bounty hunter such as yourself to be seen driven around by a woman. <laughs> well, Bonnie. Come on up, Mr. Marston. Bonnie missions are simply tutorial missions. This is how you play the game. <laughs> to drive the wagon to Armadillo. You're looking much better, considering you were almost buzzard food a couple days ago. I have you to thank for that, Miss. So tell me, have you needlessly risked your life since we left? Woo! No, miss. Drunk I driving. Well, that's a relief. Uh -oh. Perhaps there's hope for you yet. I wouldn't uh -oh. bet on it. Oh, there's always hope. Uh -oh. There we go. There we go. Be a rancher there we go. Oh, you there. Oh, that. I got this. Attitude, I got this. I got this. So. We're good. I can't think of any other way to stay got this. sane. To We're fine. Frank. What about you? Have you ever given up hope altogether? Hope hasn't really entered into it. It's not really something I think about. A peculiar outlook. I can't really say I understand you. I can't always say I do either. Oh, don't be so deliberately enigmatic. I'm not, miss. Yes, you are. You are being deliberately obscure. I love how that she were just talking. She's talking normally like nothing has happened. I just know there are two theories to arguing with women, and neither one works. I'm not even going to dignify that gibberish with a response. Coming through. Yeah, we beat Bully already. I wasn't expecting to finish it so fast, but we did. She just wants some I of the D. It's kind of funny. I found you dying on the side of the road, and now you're driving me into town. I know. Isn't that funny? Well, you must admit. Woo! <laughs> 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 I love the way they did the steering. Red Dead Redemption is like did horses the best out of any game, as they had to because horses you are so important. Where you live. They nailed it. I have a small holding up in Great Plains. A farmer? Yeah, and I'm the Queen of England. Hello, Mr. Your your Majesty. Your day of hunting down outlaws, do you find time to raise chickens? Only been at it three years or so. I guess I'm kind of new to it. You're telling me. 
So who's looking after this farm of yours right now? Uncle. Well, he's not my uncle, as far as I know. Just an old dog who's as lazy as a lizard on a hot day. <laughs> Got a fellow laboring under the delusion that age brings wisdom. Uh, sounds like the perfect person to leave in charge of your entire livelihood. We go way back, and I didn't have a lot of choice. I'd be getting back there if I was you. That's what I'm trying to do, miss. I know, I got my knees. Aren't they sexy? <laughs> Drive. God, I love the landscape. It's so How nice. How well do you know New Austin? I don't. We talked about coming down here many times. I can't wait to play Red Dead Redemption 2. Me and the folks I used to, used to work with. Yeah, New Austin. The last real outlaw country. Where the old ways still hold true. You do a man wrong, he'll shoot you for it. You do a man right? Well... Still may shoot you for it, but at least you have an idea of what's right and what's wrong there. Dear oh dear, Mr. Marston, what dreadful novel did you get that romanticized dribble out of? Those days are long gone if they were ever here at all. According to Paul, those days were just people shooting each other because they lost the cards. We'll be lucky if our ranch survives another five years. Businessmen are the new cowboys. Yeah, Red Dead Redemption 2. You know they're making it. It's gonna be on next gen consoles. It's just a matter of when, not if. It's gonna be oh, you look like so a man nice. Been through the mill. Uh, Imagine this, but so much better looking. I mean, you've lived some life. I'm 27 years old, and I have rarely left Hennigan's stead. Although many years ago, we did briefly employ a French governess. French governess. So this is Armadillo. Manhattan, it is not, but it does okay for us. Very nice little town. She's still a blabber, and she loves to talk. Most important thing for you right now is getting yourself into Dr. Johnson's office to purchase some medicine. The first one's on me. Thank you, miss. I'll pay you back. I'm sure you shall. The doc's a good fellow. He saved your life, so be polite to him. Meet um, me in front of the general store when you're done. I'm still not 100% sure I'm getting uh, Grand Theft Auto V. I don't know if I want to play it on on 720p 30 frames per second or if I would like to wait for a PC version or a next gen console version. Ill, I hope. Need some laudanum? Some laudanum? Howdy, friend. Buy some medicine, please. Finally come to get that bullet out your leg. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Stay away from the salt pork and tobacco. The salt pork and tobacco? How do you do? How to do, partner? How to? Hello, Bonnie. Well, thanks for driving me. It was nice to be able to enjoy the view for once. And a little company never hurts now and again. You're more than welcome, miss. Least I can do. Thank you for the medicine. Why don't you have a look around Armadillo? You can always take the stagecoach back to the ranch later. I might just do that. Travel safely, miss. Try not to get yourself shot. I won't be around to save you this time. Thanks for your vote of confidence, lady. How do you do? Red Dead Redemption is one of the best games of this gen. It's amazing. It's so much fun. It's so atmospheric and a great achievement. All right, I think I know what I need to do right away. I think I, without a doubt, need to go feed my addiction where's the tap is it which one is ah there they are right over here let's go feed my addiction all right hello fellas how's it going How's it going, bro? Hello there, mister. Hey. Why, hello, boy. I ain't deep. I don't have enough money. Fine, whatever. Never mind then. I have never played the the first Red Dead game because it's nothing like this. It's not even made by the same people. And that would be a waste of my time. What is that? Hey, you! Get the netted guy! Come over here! Hello there. Chicken up fuss, Mexico. Unpaid bounty on your head. So you paid off. Okay. Lawman posse will hunt you down. I heard a plate of boils is coming through soon. 
Any recommendations for five dollars? Five pounds for PC? Yeah, here. I went. Pa I don't have enough money for poker. Apparently, I have like a no nothing to my name. How much money do I have? I don't see how much money I have. Oh, there it is. I have nothing. I have no money at all. Zip. Nada. Not a dime. I am broke. Let's go do a mission, I guess then. you have nothing in your heart. Let's go do a mission over here. We'll do the, uh... We'll go do the sheriff's mission. Actually... I need to make sure I go beat up someone in the tavern at some point. Yeah, I want, doing one mission will give me a lot of money. Excuse me. Hey, hey, you got a visitor. <coughs> Shut up, you. Now, what you want? My name's John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did. Apparently so. Why? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. Oh, God, stop doing that. You that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You that one of them Williamson boys? Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him! <laughs> Come on, what? You, you getting cute with me, boy? What's going on here? Oh, I got me God. one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, no. Put your gun down. You must be the man from Blackwater. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright. But he seems loyal. Jonah, get out of here for a minute. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson, sir. And you. Oh, I done seen enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> I think there's some school children down the way you can go and frighten. Oh, party <laughs> fucking whore. <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I'm here to capture or kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're happy to have him out there? Well, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak. And suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. Whole world has problems, mister. And I'm here doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon need shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. There'll be more. All right. Tell you what. Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. You're a persistent little cuss, ain't you? Only when things matter. Come on, then, Marston. Follow me. What are we gonna do? 
Oh, we're gonna walk like badasses. Okay, go. Hello there. So who are we looking for? A bunch of two-bit hoodlums, led by this fella called Walt. Goddamn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on walking the real slow and like badass. You're happy right to now. let them drink Here's some epic salute. music. Happy? No. Oh, it's some explosions in the background. Better than carousing awesome. in there than out robbing decent folk. That's an interesting approach to law enforcement. Is the dumb rat bastard now? Let's follow him. See what kind of hole he crawls into. <laughs> Bound out, Marston. Walton's our man. <laughs> Come on. God damn it, he's on to us. Get after him. Where's my horse? And I will. I'll let your horse. There's my horse. Let's go. I'm getting after him. Catch me up. I'm coming. Let's go. Let's go, baby. If Walton's as bad as you say he is, why don't we just beef him now while we got the chance? Because that ain't how the law works. Is that right, Marshal? And alive, he can still talk. That is true. Like he's a man to be reasoned with. He ain't. But a few days of my hospitality and he'll be telling me what I need to know. Walton's gang's been growing fast. That law is easy money for easy work. Jola Springs, Gap Tooth Ridge, these boys get around. Walton's a start, but there's plenty more where he came from. Epic riding off to fight off the bandits. I know, I cannot wait for Red Dead Redemption sequel. God, I hope it comes out the next couple of years, because this game was so good. Hold up, Marston. He must be at the old Pleasant's house. Probably best we take it on foot from here. Why? Looks like we got company, boys! <laughs> Damn! Take cover! We'll work our way up this hill. Hey! Yeah, you! Yeah, over here! Marston, I got you covered! Move up to that wagon! Okay, moving up. There's one behind the crate! Take him down! Hey, you're outnumbered, Marshal! Why am I not? Strong liquor! I'll back ah, ah, ah. the hell back to the ah, ah, ah. <laughs> What are you waiting for? Why am I not I'm clinging to the cover? Wait, what button do I gotta press? Shit! God, come on. Maybe uh, if I'm not clinging the cover. Am I supposed to cling to the cover or Move up what? To that crate. I'll cover you. Like for me, I'm, I'm supposed to be able to like go up. Oh my good god! Circle. Circle doesn't. Take that feller behind the rock, boy. You ain't getting there, Walton. Come on, Marcus. Oh, it's R1. There we go. R1. Thank God. Okay, R1. There we go. Found it. Found the button. It's R1. Gotcha. You ain't outlaws. There's one behind the outhouse. I saw him. Where's the other one? Get behind that outhouse! Oh, I got sure it. We seen the I got it. I shot him in the dick, I think. Oh, that's not cool. Woo! In the face. Just walk left now. Try to take him alive. I'll try. I'll try to. Take him alive. There we go, in the leg. <laughs> Not a bad shot, Mr. Marston. 
Why don't you check in with me next time you're in town? I don't want to be no policeman, Marshal. <laughs> Nor did I, my friend. I can promise you that. I'll see you soon, Mr. Marston. Thank you, mister. Now it's time to loot the bodies. Get all the money from them. Now I'll have money for gambling. I mean, uh... Loot the body. Money. I looted that one already, didn't I? These little gray dots on the mini map are my bodies to loot. What have we got here? Money. And there's a body over here. Money. One thing you don't have to worry about in this game is ammo, because they've just everybody has like a full like several clips of ammo on it. So you never have to worry about not having a shot. And then money in there. That is worth thirty-six dollars. Hail to the yeah. You can travel quickly using feature of your camp. Choose campsite, and then I can fast travel. And choose skills like hunting, sharpshooting. Let's travel to. Go to back to Armadillo. It's cool, fast travel. <laughs> yeah, I've seen the map. Apparently, Grand Theft Auto V has a map that's bigger than this game and Grand Theft Auto IV and LA Noir combined together. Apparently, if that's true, that is huge. That is massive. And yeah, that's just huge. It's massive, but it's on the PS3 and Xbox, so it'll be fuzzy and low frame rate. But if the game's good enough, we can live with it. This is the saloon. Well, it depends on, like, a big map's cool and all, but how much of that is actually full of, uh, is full of good stuff, you know? Alright. Alright, let's pull up and do a Damn poker. Spaldings. Why can't people just go shopping like they used to? I know how to play. I played poker before. How many guys have spent hours playing this little mini game? <laughs> this might work. What do I got? Uh, I will hold that shit. No, I'm out. Next turn, please. What? You don't want to head out near Tumbleweed. Place is um, full of bad spirits. You've cleared me out. But it doesn't matter, uh, Inekwe, uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 has not been announced for PC yet, officially. Anyone's just guessing. Let's raise. And I'll raise you! Uh, mm. I'm looking a little hog tied. I've got jack shit, so... Gotta fold him. He's bluffing. Next turn. I really, if if there's gonna be a PC version or next gen version of uh, Grand Theft Auto V, they're not gonna announce it until after uh, until after um, the PS3 and Xbox versions release because they don't want um, to. I'm going to. They fold. don't want to have to. Uh, damn. I'm looking. Lose out on sales because people will cancel their pre-orders. Sixty-nine, sixty-nine. Let's go. Bet big on sixty-nine. Let's up it a bit, shall we? Let's up it, baby. Sixty-nine. Hmm. Sure could have used that last hand. Let's call sixty-nine. Call you. I knew desperation would set in. Let's call sixty-nine. And I got nothing. <laughs> Damn it, I had a 69. How did I not? Thought I had that one in the back. Must have been a 68.